Hello friends, so today we're going to discuss the problem B from the latest educational code forces round 96, problem name barrel. So you have n barrels lined up in a row numbered from like 1 till like n and like um, the initially all the barrels has containing like has some water uh, of the level AI. Okay, so as you can see like uh, you can assume that there are some barrels and now uh, every barrel has some amount of water initially present in that or in them so now what you can see there is you can pour water from one barrel to another so now uh, like you can choose one barrel and like take that water and you can pour it in some another barrel and now as you can assume uh, like that any barrel has infinite of capacity so like the barrel can hold any amount of water in that and now you have to calculate the maximum possible difference between the maximum and the minimum amount of water in the barrel what does this mean that uh, after doing this operation that you can pour this water in here or like pour this water here uh, you can do these pouring operations at most k times and after that you have to find out the possible difference between the maximum and the minimum amount of water in the barrel okay so as you can see because i want to increase the difference what is my main strategy i want to make anything so like what is the minimum possible value the minimum possible value can be zero it cannot become negative like they, it cannot be happen that a barrel can has negative water so like the minimum can be zero and the for increasing the positive what is the main strategy can be first find out which is the maximum barrel like which barrel has the maximum water and try to insert all the barrels which are like less than so let's assume that this barrel has 10 water this is 9 and this is like 7 and I have like k equal to 1 so which barrel should I insert in this I should insert this because this is the second maximum so if I k is equal to 1 insert the second maximum k equal to 2 insert this uh, third maximum and so on keep on inserting this in the maximum such that after I insert or take all this water from here this will become 0 this will also become 0 and thus automatically this will become 0 okay and after like taking out this water I will again sort this out so what I can do I will first initially sort all the all the barrels and for the like starting from this position i will keep on going from like right to left and till i have some k left if i have some k left i will take this value to be zero and insert this water in this barrel and keep on doing this and also i will make because i have inserted or taken all the water my barrel water capacity or like the number of water here is turned out to be zero and i will keep on doing this for every barrel and take out the water here uh, like from here and like put it in the maximum uh, like uh, the barrel in which it has the maximum water and thus in the end i have do like i have done k steps so now what will be my strategy is i will again sort out this like uh, the, the barrels such that like the zero will come to an, like the start and the starting element will has the uh, the minimum possible amount and the largest will has the last amount and thus I will just find out the subtraction for this and this so now why I am doing this the thing here is uh, like maybe k turns out to be 0 like maybe like I cannot do anything and thus in that case uh, because I cannot do thing uh, the minimum is the starting one and the maximum will this one so the difference between this is the uh, because I want to maximize my difference the maximum difference will be to the difference between the maximum amount of water in the in any barrel and the minimum amount of water in any barrel okay and thus if the k equal to 0 then this ca like this case can happen thus that's why i will like make this value equal to 0 and after doing this operation i will again sort this such that the minimum will come to the start and also the maximum will come to an end and then after that i will take out the one which has the minimum and the one which has the maximum subtract the maximum minus minimum and we'll get the difference so that's the logic for this question okay i i'll show you the code maybe i haven't pasted in the my the like vs code so i'll show you from here so now as you can see uh, this is the input of n and k okay i can uh, increment so like i can yeah you can see here i can like increment the size so now you can see here is this is n and k okay and then uh, like in take the input of because the values can be very large uh, it can be 10 to 1 9 that's why i've used long long and if n equal to 1 like there is only one barrel then the answer is 0 because the because there is only one barrel so the maximum will be that only and the minimum will be that only because there is only one barrel so answer is 0 maximum minus minimum is 0 uh, because what else what I'll do I will sort this out 
after sorting it out i will move from the second last value because the last value will has the maximum amount my goal will be move from the second last from right till the left and keep on adding water from here to this point and thus from the second last i will go to zero i will check that whether there is some key present if there is some key present then only i will do this operation else i will break out of this loop if there is some key present what i will do i will take out or i in the last barrel which is n minus 1 i will add the ith barrel and i will because i have done one operation i will decrement my key and also i will make this ith barrel because i have used this water to put it into the last barrel i will make this equal to 0 and thus i have done key operations again i will sort out a dot begin to a dot end and the difference is just maximum which is the last element minus the first element and that's the answer i hope you get the possible solution for this problem also if you still have any doubts mention now thank you for watching this video i'll see you next time keep coding bye